Perfect. So we're going to continue. 3.3 represent fractions. What fraction is represented by point K? So this is my point that I want. I need to see how many parts it is divided. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 is divided in 5. No, I'm so sorry. Not 5. 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6 is divided into 6 parts and the letter K goes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So it's 5 out of 6. That's my fraction for this point. Okay? And 5 out of 6 is right here. Macy ordered a pizza from Pizza World. She ate 3 pieces of the pizza. This model shows a pizza that is still left. She ate 3 pieces of the pizza. And why do we have like this? Okay, what fraction of the pizza is on the pan still? Okay. Oh, she ate these. Oh, I'm so sorry. So I don't know what I was thinking. Sometimes it takes us a while to understand. This is what she ate. That's why it's gone. So what fraction is still there? So we're going to count. One two, three, four, five. We have five out of how many pieces? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So what, fra what fraction of the pizza is on the pan still? Five eighths. There are, I'm sorry, these are the pens, pencils, and markers in Mrs. Campbell's drawer. What fraction of the writing tools are pens. So I'm just going to color the pens. So this is a pen. This oh, I, I don't know what I did. I'm supposed to use this one. So sorry. This is a pen. This is a pen. This is a pen. So how many pens do I have? Three. How many pens? Three. Out of how many utensils all together? One, two, three, four, five. Dun, da, da, dun. I have no idea whatsoever what these fractions are doing here. So, what fraction of the writing tools are pens? Three fifths. What fraction of the strip diagram is shaded? One, two, three. These are my favorites. It's like super easy. I love them so much. So out of how many? Four. Quickly, quickly. Three fourths. Yay. Very good. Okay, let's move on to the next one. 3.2D, compare and order numbers to 100,000. The table shows the amount of money less made in four months. Don't skip the table. Don't read the question. Understand the table first. So the months are November, December, January, and February. And the income is 3,000. This comma is red. 1,000. 3,943. 3,943. 3,903. Wow, these are high figures. January, 3,004, and February, 3,832. I am just, out of curiosity, I'm just going to circle the highest one is this one. And the lowest one is this one. Which list shows the months in order from least to greatest? Mm -hmm. So, least, it must begin with January. So, I can see November, and this one is wrong. Greatest, it must end in November. This one ends in December, so this one is wrong. So I got the two that are totally wrong, so I need to decide the ones in between. So what goes next after November? I think December is next. So you must have... Uh, December and then November, or let's do least to greatest. So 3,004, which is January, and then February, 3,800. So January, February, December, and November. This is my right answer, and this one was my distractor. These clues are about a mystery number. The number has a digit less than three, that is zero, 
one or two in the thousands place. So I can do this. Remember, the comma is read thousand and you have three spaces next. So it can be that this number can be a zero, this number can be a one, or it can be a two. I guess it cannot be really be a zero because then you don't have any thousands there. It's greater than 70, oh wait, but it has 10 thousands here. So yes, we could have a zero. So it's greater than 71,932. And it's less than 72,569. So let's analyze the numbers and you see if they fall in between. So 72,932, it says is greater than this number. So this is the same number that can be, right? Let's analyze the other one. 71,091. It's greater than 71,900. This one can be because it's less. 71,000. 71,932 has to be greater than that number. And this one is 71,034. This one is not greater than that number. So this is my only choice. Is greater than 71,900? Yes, because it's 72,000. Is it less than 72,500? Yes, because it's 400. And does it have a two or one or a two or a zero in the thousands place? Yes, okay, this one fulfills all the requirements. In which number sentence is the number 85,038 missing? Ooh, we need to put them in order. So this is less, the big opening goes to the big number, the big opening goes to the big number. So you're putting, putting the numbers in order from least to greatest, okay? So you, you want 85,000, that's easy, all of them have 85,000, but you need, you're missing 38. This one is 137, which is greater than 38. This one cannot be because 137 is more than 38, so it won't make sense here. Let's find the other one. Eight, 85,003 is less than 38. So 38 could actually fit in here. So 85,000, which is the same for everybody, for all of the numbers, and 38 could make sense here because you have three, and then 38, and then 300. That makes sense. Let's try the other ones. 223 is greater than 38, so this one makes no sense. 130 is greater than 38, so that one makes no sense. So this is my right answer. The table shows the length of four rivers in the world. I'm not gonna skip the table, I'm gonna read it. Mississippi, 6,270. Nile, 6,690. Yangtze, 6,380. Amazon, 6,387. And I always need to identify which one is the greatest. Which one is the greatest? The Nile is the greatest. I need to identify which one is the um, shortest river. So that will be, this one is the shortest one because it has 270, okay? Which comparison of two river lengths is not true? We're looking for not true. The length of the Mississippi River is less than, because can you see? The length of the Mississippi River is less than the length of the Amazon River. And that is actually true. So this is true. I am looking for the one that is not true. The length of the Nile River is greater than the length of the Yaxi River. And this is actually true because this one has six and this one has 300. So this is true. The length of the Yangtze River 
is less than the length of the Amazon River. And you know what? It is less by a slight, it's the slightest difference ever, but the Yangtze River is seven miles shorter than the Amazon. So this is actually true. The length of the Amazon River is greater than the length of the Nile River. And this is not true. This is the one that is false. This is the one we were looking for. Because actually the Amazon River is shorter than the Nile. Very good. And we finished.